Welcome to BeMoreNews.com, the news before the news where we uncover the truth here in Niagara Falls, New York. Freedom Crossing Monument. It was where along the Niagara River in the mid-1800s that enslaved African Americans from the southern United States first saw Canada known as the Promised Land where they could live free forever. Local volunteers led by jo Josiah Tryon helped the freedom seekers by transporting them across the river. By rope. Welcome to BeMoreNews.com the news before the news where we Absolutely amazing. I met the artist that did this. She had small replicas of this too. And she said she was just so inspired. She went down in here and tried to figure out how she wanted to capture the face of the people. <laughs> Freedom crossing. Slave the custom house who sought a new life of freedom in, in Canada Canada Center. Center. to the local volunteers who helped them on their okay. journey to cross you have to come and see that. the Niagara River. What would you do to get across this water to freedom? To leave slavery and oppression? Men lynching and raping, destroying lives. What would you do? What would you give to get to freedom? What would you do? What would you give? What would you sacrifice to make it across that water right there? After a transatlantic slave trade, after working in cotton fields, to watching rapes, beatings, castrations, what would freedom cost for you? What would be the price? What would you give to get over to that land, to that land right over there, to Canada? Be more news com the news before the news where we uncover the truth. This is Freedom Crossing. United States, Canada. Across the water.